Alright, back to sanity this episode. Generic greetings, fellow citizens of the internet. This is, of course, Richard on my own this time, and today I bring you another episode of my Revelation DIS play. Um, sorry about last episode. It was kind of zany. But I'll try and go through just a bit and sort of, you know, not, not be quite as crazy this time. So as you'll recall, I left this room rather quickly because of because of that and other things. Just the general atmosphere, I left it rather quickly without realizing that just over here was a very relevant looking book. Uh, so, uh, and this is part of why I was waiting on doing journal sorts of things until I had the amulet because it does something very cool. Check this out. I cannot believe I resisted linking here for so long. Father's warning kept me away. He said Haven was an age of great wealth, but visiting it would be dangerous without him. Lying serpent. Should have known he would say anything to keep Cirrus and me under his control. I despise him. But look, Father. Look who's under whose control now. Stinking rain has not let up much since I arrived. It gets almost too quiet. But it does, except for the distant screams of animals. Wonder what exists beyond those cliffs. Too wet to find out tonight, but there should be plenty of time for treasure hunting tomorrow. Judging by the chests in this wreck, I will not be disappointed. <laughs> oh, but won't Cyrus be enraged? when he sees I got all the emeralds first. Been slashing through the jungle all week and have yet to run into any people. What did you do, Father? Get them to turn this island into some kind of wild animal park? It would be just like you to convince the stupid idiots to do that. I have to hand it to you, though. The heads on some of these beasts will look really good on my walls. <laughs> so yeah, you get to you get to know the characters just a bit through these journals, and this sort of takes uh, an idea. Except for the distant screams of animals. Um, um, stop, stop, stop for a second. Um, I'm talking here. Uh, so yeah, it it um sort of takes a principle that's been um explored in the uh, earlier Mist games, sort of to a whole nother level. Uh, cause all throughout the Mist games there have been these journals, um, records that people have kept of their journeys in various ages or whatnot, um, that have held a lot of exposition and told sometimes really deep and, um, amazing stories about, um, you know, characters and places and all that kind of thing. Uh, but this takes it to a whole new level cause it, you know, gives you a convenient excuse to actually hear the person's um, voice like talking about what they're doing and so forth and it makes the journals a lot more uh, a lot easier to read because uh, you don't actually even need to proactively read them they they go out of their way to read to you um, so it's really cool and I guess I'll go through the rest of this journal because I believe that it's all relatively interesting and worthwhile information Camadiles, that's right, that's you what I my first for. taste of primate today. I uh. was cutting a path through the jungle when one of the stupid buggers clunked me from behind with a piece of fruit. It scared the hell out of me. I whipped around ready to slice and dice, nice but I let out this ear-piercing shriek. It must have been a signal to its buddies, because they all took off into their nests. <laughs> Too bad Mr. Shrieker wasn't fast enough. That is grim. What's a Zephter Camadial Mangri? Got my first taste. No, stop, stop, stop. stop Man, okay. is it hot. Actually starting to like these infernal thunderstorms. They ruin a good day of hunting, but at least they cool things down for a while. Surprised my greedy brother hasn't shown up yet. He's got to know I skipped out on him in Serenia after we called that little truce. He's insane if he thinks his plan there will work. We should just kill Father and be done with it. Nice guy. Nice guy. Then again, maybe I should link back to Mist and convince Cirrus to set the old man free here in Haven. After all these weeks of practice. 
My hunting and tracking skills have really improved. Really nice guy. Really nice guy. No way, no way, no way. It's got to be here somewhere. Got to be. I searched, searched, and searched. Where's the blasted linking book? I have to pull myself together. Come up with a plan. That's what Cirrus would do, wouldn't it? Isn't it? He... Where the hell is Cirrus? Doesn't matter. Need a base. Some place to hold up in. Some... Stop it! Link. The ship. It'll do for now. Till I build something better. Got to be easier to get into, though. Easier. But protected against intruders. Got to protect myself, right? Good. That's good. That's... I'm gonna kill you for this, old man! He was always a bit crazy, even the original game. I slashed the beast. There was blood spurting everywhere. I need a better spear. Disappeared down the wind tunnel. That's another thing. It was a very mm. successful day today. Mostly Karnax. Figuring out how to use their fishing habits against them was sheer genius. Again, Karnax. Yeah, they fly. Can't escape. I was right. Mm. I must... Wrongful imprisonment. Where is Cirrus? Last few days, too much blood. I don't remember killing so many animals. Talk slower. Is something else here? The episode isn't on. Something big. Second predator hunting me. Why haven't I seen it yet? But yeah, it also the memory thing also allows you to I hear slash. stuff that. Figured it out. Away. Wicked okay. brother. Lying tongue of snake. Tricked me with truth. Serenia. <laughs> Cirrus is trapped too! While I... Machines. He linked to Spire in search of plunder. <laughs> Spire! Father's other dangerous age! Miserable Hello. camodile. Bloody animal. Nearly ripped my leg off. Pulled vanishing act and... Just wait till hunting post is finished. Nice, nice, nice touch there, Aknar. Thanks. Saw some more tracks. Brainwashed most of them away. But then, I found them. But definitely tracks. Sneaky bastard. Think he waits. And then there was the fifth kill site. Look fresh. Orny was bigger. Smelled me coming and took off. What is this thing? Pace is definitely slower the than the size. Me. Impossible. Hands still shaking. Didn't expect. Didn't expect attack. Didn't realize. Magnificent. Definitely a lot slower than I remember. Still, but... see him rearing out of sea, water spilling down gills. Such malice, such death in his <laughs> eyes. Sun sinking behind, reflection so bright, nearly blinded. Must have planned it that way, must have known. But I'm That's alive, sea spawn. Still alive, and I will defeat you. As death is my witness, I shall decorate my kingdom with your bones. Indeed. So yeah, um, that is the journal, which I missed. Uh, <laughs> safe to say that that does in fact add quite a bit of depth to Aknar's character and his predicament and so forth. Down the ladder, no, down the ladder, down the ladder. Not that difficult. And he was definitely, he's, he's, he's not a stellar example of, you know, pillar of sanity in the, um, in a wasteland of, you know, 
hopelessness. He's, as a matter of fact, rather, rather crazy. But he always was. Um, even in the early, um, the first first game he showed up in was actually the first missed game, of course, and he was pretty loopy there as well. So this is <laughs> reasonably accurate portrayal. Uh, where was the ladder? The ladder was right over here. So I happened to notice as I was walking away that the um, puzzle actually. What am I doing? Staring up at the sky. <laughs> um, let me grab this over here. Yeah, here it is. Uh, the notes! Notes. Because I happened to notice the third time uh, that as I was walking away from the bridge thing, uh, I did in fact reset. Uh, so I'll have to redo that. Re-enter the little passcode thingummy that he set up. Um, the last one that uh, Artemis, Artemis and I worked to... Um, fool around with last time. Am I going in the right direction? I'm not totally sure. I haven't had a junction yet, have I? Where? I don't know where I'm going. I'll just go this way, and hopefully that'll be good. It looks promising, I think. Right? Right? Oh yeah, there's, there's, the, there's the gate. There's the gate. So far, so good. Should be this way, right? Yes, yes, okay, right over here. Very good. Don't mind me, don't mind me. Yeah, I think if you click through the landscape too quickly, the um, animals actually react differently. Like, that one got scared away immediately as I approached, rather than, like, if I was slowly going through a bit more carefully, then wouldn't have, probably wouldn't have been startled. All right, so let me let me go through this again. Uh, what did we decide? I think we went down that side of the thing. Uh, so it was the sea spawn, which was the box. Then the uh, camadile, which was triangles. Yeah, reading reading the journal. It's um, Interesting to see where he was coming from with all this. Uh, then the, um... Uh, what was it? Uh, then, then the next one was, um... Is it Mangrees? No, Mangrees were the second one. The third one was... Karnax. Karnax. Uh, right? Yeah, should be. Uh, which was the hourglass. Then, to get this one, I'll check this one. Uh, and that would be the Zephlers, Zephters, whatever it was, which were the, like, sideways S thing. So let me do that. Nope. That. And line this one up like that. Then align this one to be the Mangries, which were the four... Um... That one. I think, right? No. Nope. What did I do wrong? Um... Is there another symbol here that I'm supposed to be doing? Is it, is it this one? I didn't think it was this one. No, okay. Let me quickly watch back the footage and <laughs> see what I'm doing wrong so that I don't waste too much more time solving a puzzle that I already solved. Alrighty, feel kinda silly. I just completely botched the order is all. Um, so this should be the Mangries, uh, then, uh, second was Karnax, uh, which was what? No, that's, that's wrong. Uh, Karnax was the, yeah, that, so align that to that, very good, and then this was the, um, the Zephler Zephter things, uh, which were the S bend. Yep, I was right. Good. So that should be it. There we go. Okay. Ah, feel silly. Feel silly. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. Lens flare. Okay. That was just the um little box dropping back to its proper position. So, new territory, 
New territory. Oh, interesting. It lifts itself up again. So. Oop. Broken door. So. Sort of a more proper home. Uh, let's see. What is there to see around here? Aha! That looks promising. Another bed! Another book! Not sure I can do this. Pan feels awkward. Keeps slipping. Been so long since I used one. But what else is there? What else to do? Went back to wreck today. First time since moving into house. Found his bones exactly how I left them. Except clean now. Bleached white by the sea. How many times have I replayed it since then? Sun sinking into the waves. Tip of my spear gleaming wet with the poison. See myself crouching low near the rock, so sure he will come because of his mate. Sometimes in my head, it happens different. Poison gets diluted, or one of her ropes snaps and breaks. He rears back, spear misses. Somehow they both get away. And we all get one more day worth living for. Reset traps today. Swamp water corroded one of them. Forced to go to depot to fix. Coming back, saw a Kamadal take down a Zeftir. Zeftir. Moved with such precision, not a single gesture wasted. Zeftir probably didn't feel a thing. It's not what I expected, living lakeside. It's calmer, not as windy. But rain still beats down like in the wreck, and it's hot. Still hot. Only real difference is the screens. A lot closer now, on all sides. Starting to get on my nerves. Can't sleep. Too many screams. And when I close my eyes, the things I see, the faces, my god, Cirrus, did we really kill so many? Added it up, best I could. Eight years, three since I killed the last Serpati. Keep thinking I should do something for him. Play some kind of tribute next to the bones. Totem pole, maybe. God knows. Carving it would keep me busy for a while. Maybe I can make one for each of them. Which explains the totems. What's the use? What's the use? Can't go on like this. Can't think. Have to do something. Keep my mind off the dreams. Maybe, maybe go south for a few days, sleep outside. My godfather did it have to be the same? Two weeks working my way through the south jungle, and for what? More of the same, more of the same, empty nothingness. Can't take it anymore. Can't live like this. Karnax got in while I was away. Forgot how agile they are. Braver, too, when they're hunting in groups been breeding like mad ever since I killed their primary predator. Should probably do something about that. But maybe I can redesign one end of the bridge. Create some kind of lock to keep them out. Probably wildly unnecessary and... Went back to the south jungle today, <laughs> hoping I'd missed some... thing. <laughs> Saw a group of mangries playing under their nests. Thought about replenishing supplies, but couldn't do it. They just looked too peaceful. Eventually turned to go and spied one of them watching me. 
Their lookout, I suppose. Wonder how long he knew I was there. Ink supply getting low. Watering it down, but might try to make more. The way the channel would tree dwellers once taught me. Channelwood, other age from long. Found some petals back. in the south jungle that might work for the ink. Picked a few to take back as an experiment. While picking them, I noticed something odd about the mangrees. In the north, they all scatter as soon as they spot me, but the south tribe only looks curious. Must be because I never hunted them. New ink seems okay. Would prefer a better color, though. I'll head back to the South Jungle in the morning, see if I can find different varieties. I don't believe it. Went back to gather more petals and found a bunch of them already picked. They were lying in a pile where I'd been working. Mangrees must have done it. Imitating me? Spent most of the morning in the watchtower trying to observe from a distance. Find out how they act when I'm not there. Couldn't see much though, trees are too thick. Would like to get closer somehow. I suppose I could build another post, but it'd have to be different this time. Not a lot left I can take from the wreck. Kinda like the idea of going all natural. How the heck did Savidro's people do it? <laughs> Game three. Been weaving support branches all day and my arms and chest muscles are killing me. Mangri sure got a kick out of watching though. One of them even stopped playing long enough to come over and give me advice. At least that's how it seemed. Wouldn't stop chirruping at me. Made me want to rig up another sound system, see if I can try and talk back. Oh my god. It can't be. It can't. This evening, I was sketching in the post, trying to get their expressions right. Mangrees were playing that game they liked to play, fruit tossing. Ball must have rolled under the post. All of a sudden, I heard this cry I'd never heard before. A sequence of drawn out highs and lows. Looked up and found all of them looking at me, pointing at the ball and making that sound like they were calling a name. My name. They've given me a name. What am I supposed to do with this, Father? What am I supposed to do? Ladies and gentlemen, how to reform your villain 101. <laughs> Please! I can't take it anymore! It's too late. It's too late. They're all dead. All of them. Cool little telescope thing here. Can I see anything cool? There's the dock thing there. I think that might be where the totem is, maybe? Oh, maybe that is. Maybe that's where the totem is. I think that I think that's where the Karnak totem was. I love the pinnacles, the crazy tall spires jutting up from the rocks. The dragonflies are cool too. Um Also please note that the South Jungle is just slightly greener. Not as green as the swamp, but slightly greener than the North Jungle. Can I... Yeah. Come on, they should have 
had some births by now. Why aren't they reproducing? Oh, God. What if I kill too many females? At this rate, I don't even need to say anything this episode, Jesus. I can just, <laughs> just listen to memories and so forth. Huh. But, so let's see. Oh, yep, yep. Uh, he de he started developing codes, as you can see. Like these are the same pots as before. We've got the high, medium, low. Um, you can see short and then long. Um, so short on the low and then long high. Um, connected with Mangri. getting into painting. Do I remember correctly? Um, it is... There's a reasonably long-standing tradition in Myst games that if something is waving in the breeze, there's probably something behind it. Um, maybe not, though. Maybe I'm remembering wrong. There's definitely something behind there. There's definitely something behind there. Can I do something from this screen? Ah, yep, I can. Sure enough. Ah, ah. Ah. Why can't I get the expression right? It's something. Something about the eyes. The eyes have it. I apologize. Uh, so let's see. Uh, I think that's basically all there was to see here. But you begin to see um, that Aknar uh, has. Get. How can I. Come on. Get, get down. Can I not get down from here? Do I need to get down from over here? Uh, get, bring it down the down the ladder. No, down down the down. <laughs> Navigation in this game can be dodgy. Oh, I need to go over here and then go down. Okay, right. Um, but yeah, um, the one of the one of the most nasty characters in the Mist series. Um, and they've managed to <laughs> make him pull a believable 180, which is rather impressive. But check this place out. This, like, this vegetation right here alone is just amazing. Uh, and the um, seamless transition from beach to jungle again, again, is also quite nice. Um... <laughs> I'm done gawking at the scenery. Uh, actually, I'm not sure how long this episode's getting. Uh, I should probably check before too long. Those journals took up a lot of time. Um, There's definitely one thing about the journals. Um, whoa! Hi! Hello! Don't mind me. Um, I'll go ahead and not go that way. Um, so I'll go ahead and very quickly check what kind of time I'm looking at, and if, um, I suspect that this episode, um, is getting on toward the long side, so, if so, I will bid you farewell, and if not, then I will be right back. Okay, yeah, we're on the long side, so I'll go ahead and round this off right here. Uh, but look forward to what will most likely be the conclusion of Haven um, next time. We'll see. I'm not sure how long uh, the rest of this will take. Um, but yeah. Cool stuff. Very cool stuff. Very cool stuff. See you next time.